All right, a bit of a big weather day. Let's talk about it. Meteorologist Byron uh, Miranda. Yeah, we're going to see some snow. Not that big of a deal. Not it's winter that, after all. It, it is winter. And we're going to see some flakes flying a little bit later today. So what we're looking at right now, you can see the live radar is dry. What we have issues with is this area of low pressure that is to the south of us. It is really not well organized. And you can see the moisture. Once my name's out of the way, you can see the moisture down here. Uh, and it's kind of a split flow. So models are indicating that we could pick up one to two inches of snow. Uh, you know, what's interesting is that the models continue to hammer out a good amount of snow, it says, in the colors. When you see the darker shades over Union City, Hackensack, through Stanford, through Queens, uh, back to Staten Island, when you see these colors, that's normally a snow shower, and that would occur by 1.30. But I don't know. Looking at the radar, it seems problematic. Uh, no matter what, we have the temperatures so close to freezing and above freezing that we're going to see a mix between, say, noonish until about 7, 8 o'clock tonight, and then it goes away after 10, 11 o'clock. So watch the temperatures. As I said, it's always temperature dependent for the snow to stick on the ground. And we're at 33 at 11.30, so that's not going to have anything stick on the ground. However, once the snow starts, the temperature should drop, and then by 1 p.m. it does. Is it 32? So, okay, we got 32 at 1.30, but up until 5 or up until 4, we've got freezing, and then we're back above freezing at 5 p.m. And this is what we've had so many different times with some of these storms inside sliders uh, that you get uh, the temperature so close to either freezing or above freezing that you don't see a lot of snow stick because it's just too warm on the, at the surface. Here's the model with the most. It says one, maybe one and a half inches possible. Again, that's nothing to write home about, right? But it would be nice to see some snow. So two to three north and west where there's colder air right now. Big story is not going to be today. The big story is the Arctic air, the frigid air headed this way by the end of the week. Your current temperatures, we're feeling warmer than we have in the last couple of days because we're at freezing or above, 32 to 34. Ah, we're going to be there all afternoon, 32 to 34. By Friday into Saturday with winds out of Canada, watch what happens here. Okay, so Tribeca 4, Friday. These are wind chills. I don't care about the air temperature. I care about how you're going to feel. Jersey City, 3, and Dix Hills feeling like 2 degrees, feeling like 2 degrees. That's Friday. So right now we're talking 32. We're talking about feeling 30 degrees colder than some areas in the tri-state. Sunday, things will get a little bit better. Uh, we're with the winds light out of, uh, well, this is now Saturday. So Saturday shows you that we could be at two below zero for Tribeca, Jersey City one below, Ardsley minus four, and then Dix Hill three below. Uh, that is the real story. Not that we'll see some snow today. The real story is the Arctic blast by Friday and Saturday. Not looking good. Uh, but, you know, folks want to see some snow, so we'll go with snow today, 32. Uh, to 33 this afternoon, depending on the time and the snow. And then by Wednesday, we'll get up to 40 and right back downhill uh, Friday and Saturday.